Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2019 with the Rude Man. We're back on Kiwi. Uh, I can't remember the name of it. It's Kiwi Starter Map or something like that. It's multi fruit and it's version 0.3 something. So it is a newer version. I played this map before, but I don't think I recorded it. When I played it before, it was only version 1. Point something or 2. Point something. So uh, I'm back on it now, and again, the reason I chose this map is because it has compost, and I haven't seen a map that had compost yet, so uh, I've got a reason to have uh, my compost maker out. I learned something else on, on modding, too. They, uh, somebody told me, because I wasn't sure about the, um, the lime maker, the lime factory, because I read it, it said water and lime. Now, there it says water and then an underscore or line and lime. I was reading that sign wrong. I thought it took water and lime. It takes water and water makes lime. So the only thing I can figure out besides magic is that the water is really hard mineral water. Uh, there, I've, I've lived in places where you had to have a water softener because the water was so hard that all of your uh, all of your faucets would get clogged up from li from uh, lime deposits and and mineral deposits because there's so much uh, minerals and stuff in the water. Now where I live on the coast, it rains all the time and it's very soft water. Uh, it's all sand. We live on sand. It's a coast, and um, the sand uh, naturally um, you know filters the water when it rains, and so we have very soft water. Anyway, so all I have to do is bring some water over here, and I've got lime being made, so let's do that. And when I left, the in the last episode when I left, I was getting a second, there's the water, I was getting a second um, um, cedar. So let's do this. Let's see, we don't need a large tractor for water. Uh, let's see what we got in small tractors. Do I have any small tractors? I do have a, a small fent. But what do I have in medium tractors? I don't know. I hate to buy a small, small tractor. Because then it's pretty much used only for one thing. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to get this Lamborghini. I like the Lamborghini. It's a tough little tractor. And it's pretty. Oh, so pretty. So we don't need global positioning, but I will put a bigger engine in it. Let's see, it's from 224 to 263. So we'll get the bigger engine. There's nothing else you can mod on this. So let's buy that. And uh, I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna need a weight for it. I'm just gonna haul some water, right? So let's get a water tank. I don't think I have one. So, let's see, we're going to go up in here, and a slurry tank? Where would the water tank be? Animal transport. I mean, it's not a poo-poo tank. Miscellaneous? All right, well, this one hauls liquids, but I know I've got... Where's the universal stuff I've got? I've got I've got some universal tanks in here. A mod, I believe. And it may be in the slurry tanks. Let's take a look. Nah, that doesn't look like what I want. Well, that does haul water, and it hauls a number of different things. This is a universal type tank. So I could get this. It hauls water and it hauls milk and it hauls um, uh, for liquid fertilizer and herbicide and it also hauls fuel. So that would be a good one to get. Let's get that one. And it comes in green. I don't want green. Let's do a blue, pretty blue. And then how about maybe a lighter shade of blue? That's better. The design is white. Design is red. Red or white. Let's do red, I guess. Wheel setup. Oh, that's got some fat tires. Let's just use the normal. 
Right. Okay. That should get us set. Let's run and check our new equipment. I've got that cedar that I bought. You know what I should do is I should start these things up again. Let's do that. And also, I've been told uh, by a couple people that uh, poppy is, is poppy is the best-selling crop, believe it or not. And it was pointed out to me, and I've said it myself many times, without production on a farm, there's no reason to grow anything if you're going to sell it and you, and you can't make anything out of it. There's no reason to grow it unless it's got the highest price. That being said, because a Giant never gives us any type of production, all they do is give us equipment, farmland, and a place to sell it. So the whole basic concept of this game is grow something and sell it. Grow it and sell it. Grow it and sell it. Well, if the price is better for one item over another, then there's no reason for you to do grain or potatoes or any other crop unless you're going to feed it to an animal. Uh, you might as well just always do the same crop. That's why I get upset whenever there's a new uh, game out. Um, did I have a course here? Or was I just doing... Hang on. I'm ranting right now. Harvest, there it is. Alright, let's do that. Um, that's why I always get upset with Giant when they come out with a new game. They haven't changed anything. In, in Farm 17 to Farm 19, there's so little difference. And that now I'm, I'm talking about gameplay. I'm not talking about graphics. I'm not tr talking about physics. I'm not talking about the things they've added to. They added horses. Woo hoo hoo. Um, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about there's no production. There's no reason for you to grow one product over another. If there was um, now now that's not that's not necessarily true in. A total respect and I say that because we they did have add oats and the horses do eat oats so there's a reason to grow oats but we have to wait until modders do something like uh, make a, a cotton mill or okay you can grow cotton and you can take it to a place and and um, and sell it uh, or, or make um, Hanes underwear out of it. You know what I mean? Giant needs to do something like that. They need to change the dang game. Essentially, Farm Sim 13, 15, 17, and 19, in that respect, hasn't changed a whole hell of a lot. All right, hang on. We got field five grain to silo. Let's do that. Drive the course. Now let's move on. Let's see. This guy's done. I think. I don't know what he's doing. I need to get this guy going for sure. Uh, I think in the last episode I lined him up and said, "Hey, we're running out of time." So let's see. This is field nine. Let's get him multating. And then I can go on to uh, the water and the other cedar, the smaller cedar. Now initially, all I'm gonna do is set up a course for field number nine, but as you can see, there's grass everywhere. There's grass everywhere, so. Let's just set this up for now. All right, so let's uh, generate a course. It's gonna be field nine. Whoops. Current vehicle position automatic, deactivated, blah, 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 blah. Headland. Let's do one, I guess, just because 
We're going to do one. We're going to do counterclockwise because I'm in this corner here and I want to go counterclockwise. So let's do that. And it's not three meters, so let's go 14 meters and generate the fee of the course. That was quick. And then we need to save it. So field nine mo and then drive the course okay onward uh what did i just where's my lamborghini hey where's my lamborghini did i not i don't think i I don't think I uh, committed to that. Let's try that again. Did I not commit to the Lamborghini? All right. That's probably not. I probably didn't. I don't need that. I did do that. And then I said bye, but I don't think I did. Oh, I don't have enough money. Are you kidding? Oh, all right, I gotta sell something. Well, let's get our water guy, uh, uh, our our cedar guy going. I didn't realize I was broke. How the heck did that happen? I've already dented my new water tank. So guess what I'm going to be planting? I'm going to be planting poppies if that's the best price. And uh, because I need money evidently right now. I'm going to go cross country because I'm in a hurry. Looks like a nice rig, doesn't it? Smart choice. I don't know what that means. May not mean anything. By the way, I put in a new mod. If you remember, I was repairing equipment. And somebody mentioned to me that I could go in and just change the length of time that it takes to erode uh, a piece of equipment until it needs repair. Now, what you don't know is because you don't see me modding these things. Generally, when I mod a piece of equipment, I change it from 600 hours to 6,000 hours. So I've already done that. Uh, I could I could go some ridiculous amount of time. <clears throat> well, 6,000 hours kind of is, but. I could do that. Now, I actually uh, sometimes pro would forget. So, I need to check on that cedar. That was the problem I had was the cedar. That I needed to, this one here, needed repairing, I think it was. And, you know, so I could check on that and see if I changed this one. But beside the point, that's beside the point. Uh, what, what, um, what I did was I put in a new, let me find my, this wasn't the farm, was it? Yeah, this wasn't the farm I was working on. It was Don Diego. It was Don Diego. This one doesn't need repairing, but what I did was I put in a mod that lets you tab from one piece of equipment to another if you're on the repair site so let me see do I have a repair site here I think I do I think it's over yonder <clears throat> this um there it is this thing's a little bit big for this farm isn't it right now I'm gonna get bigger fields but 
Okay, supposedly now, if I if I get on this thing here, and I had a dolly, here's my problem. I kept having to move the equipment or unhook the equipment. Now there's a mod that um, that will let you tab through the different equipment, or so they said. Let me see. There it goes. So I can tab back and forth between the equipment that it sees. It doesn't see the tractor because the tractor's too far away, but you'll notice I've got two pieces of equipment there. If it was a truck with a dolly, that was the problem I was having. It would see both trailers, but it didn't see the dolly. That meant I had to unhook the trailers from the dolly, pull the dolly over, and have it repaired. Well, in this case, if there was a dolly there, you could tab through and it would see it. Okay, so that's what that mod does. Now, somebody else told me that I could just go to the garage. But there's a problem with that. You can go to your garage and you can look at a piece of equipment and um, and maybe tell what it needs repairing. If you go to, let's see, if you go to, okay, I don't want to buy it. Am I in the garage? Sell, back, lease. Supposedly there's a repair in here, but the problem is it doesn't tell you at what percent. So it, in, it may show up at when it's 50%. I don't think so, because I had a piece of equipment that was over 70% uh, in need of repair and it didn't show up here so does this thing have to be almost uh, gone before it actually shows up here I don't know I'll have to check but we'll do that later in the meantime though let's see what do I have in fruit because I need money 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 okay what do I have I've got a little bit of this a little bit of that I don't have any I don't have anything to sell Nope, I don't. I'm going to have to grow something to sell before I can buy that. Okay, I don't have anything. It's a brand new map. I'm um, broke. I can't sell anything. So, where's he going? Where are you going, buddy? Do you think there's a full load? Oh, maybe there is. All right, need to get this guy off the field. Because his job is done. 33 and 34. Um, I think there's fruit on the other. Let me just pull this guy out of the way here. All right, and I am still having... If you remember, in the first episode, I said I was having a little bit of a lag problem when I get around all this production. I'm still having that. So. This is set on Clover. I don't want that. I'm going to do some poppies because evidently that's the best price. And I need money. Oh, are you kidding? This one doesn't do poppies. Is it? Which is millet poppies? There it is. All right. Okay, so we need some seed and fertilizer. I think this might be liquid fertilizer. So let's just pull up till we get to the seeds. Yeah, this mod right here, I have not modded uh, myself, so I, I may need to do that. It doesn't hold very much. I may have to remod this, make it hold a little bit more. Uh, those are seeds. Where's the fertilizer? Does this thing not do fertilizer? Uh-oh. This thing might not do fertilizer. Maybe it does. Maybe it doesn't. It does.
All right, we're off like a shot. Now I've got these little tiny fields and that's why I wanted the small cedar. And I'm gonna do the same thing I did when I did the uh, plowing and stuff. I don't want it to jump fields. So I'm gonna start on this side here. And uh, we're gonna go that way so that it doesn't, if I start over on that corner, I'm afraid that it, it'll get over here and it'll it'll do both fields. Which I don't care if it does, because they're both gonna be poppy, so. All right. Here we go. So we're gonna be on seeding. Uh, we're gonna do course generation. This is field 33. 33, everything's automatic. We're gonna go one of those and we're gonna go counterclockwise. And 18 meters is the deal. Let's generate that course. Save it. Uh-oh. Go back. Field 33. Okay, got it, got it, got it. I forgot that quick. Field 33. Seed. And then... Somebody's slipping. And again, I did not, I don't think I did, but let me see if I can make this go a little faster. By golly, I can. So there you go. All right, we'll see how he does. Let me go find out who's stuck. Oh boy, what are you doing? He's playing contortionist here. All right, we're gonna grab another load here as soon as he gets turned around. All right, Whistling Pete, catch up. Whoops, you're spilling canola. All right, bye-bye. Okay, uh, now the canola, I'm not selling the canola because I want to make fuel out of it. So that's what we're going to do with the canola. So I'm not going to sell it. I got a couple people playing this kiwi farm now. Uh, it's it's I don't know. It, I had fun with it before, but I don't remember recording it. Uh, but now that I can put all this production on, because there wasn't the the first time I played kiwi, uh, there wasn't any production. So uh, we've got several mods now that we can do, including uh, compost, and this particular map has been prepared for compost. That's the only one I know of that I can use the compost uh, machine on. Now, let's see. Which one of those factories did fuel? Is that... Uh, there it is. Right there. So let's start producing some fuel. And then the next thing I do, I do need to plant the things for pig food and for, so so poppies, I probably shouldn't have done. 
Pro poppies for sale, yes, but... All right. How come I'm not getting a... There it is. Wasn't uh, far enough in, I guess. Anyway, I, I do need uh, cattle food so and pig food. So I do need to plant uh, potatoes, sugar beets, uh, some form of grain. I'll look in a minute here. God, horses are making a bunch of noise. What's up, horses? All right, I'll let him take over. I don't know what he's going to do. We'll find out later. Okay. So, I do have other fields, so let me go see... Let's see, this one needs to be seeded. That one is being seeded. Is he out of seeds already? Okay, we've got uh, ready to harvest here, rye. And we're not gonna get a very good uh, deal on it. This is growing, oh my God, this is growing. Uh, there's no fertilizer. Huh? Oats, no fertilizer. Wait a minute, what the heck? Did I buy a fertilizer thing in my bobber doodle? I'm out of money. I can't I can't buy any more equipment. Oh jeez, I'm gonna be in trouble. Cause I don't think I did. Where'd all my money go? I had tons of money. Okay, this isn't right. I had tons of money. I sold all the equipment that was originally on here. Um, crop protection, garage. I didn't, I didn't buy any. Oh, you know what? I spent all my money on all that production. I bought all of that junk instead of equipment, all of that stuff. I should have put that on the farm and then put, you know, that should have been placed on the farm. Before, instead of spending my money to buy all that junk. Shoot. Well, what's done is done now. I can't, I can't do anything. I'm going to have to, um, I'm going to have to use that liminator thing. Here. What am I going to do? I got a little bit of room out here. Let me let me see what happens if I um, okay. Can I unload? I can unload. All right, I unloaded that. I'm gonna have to pick it up when I need lime. But right now, I need fertilizer. All right. I don't know what happened. Where's my money? That's what I did. I had money, and I spent it all on that production. All that cost me money. I really should have set the map up first with all of that production and then um, and then started the game. Oh, Will. Wilbur! This guy's done. Let's stop him. Get him out of the road. Now, there's a lot of grass out here. I wonder if this is cuttable. I hope it is. Let me test that theory out. What if it's not? That would be a bummer. Oh boy, I hope I bought a quicker picker upper.
All right, it is. It's cuttable. All right. Did I? Oh my god, what if I didn't get a quicker picker up? What the heck? You're not even in the right field. Uh oh, is that combine done? Boy, if I didn't get a quicker picker up, or I'm going to be in trouble. I'm going to have to lease one. Must be getting close to summer. The ice cream truck just went by. Well, it's not a truck. It's like a little go-kart uh, type thing. Not a go-kart. Um, little little golf cart type thing that uh, they sell ice cream out of. It's it's a cuter and all get out. I didn't hear the music, though. Summer must be here. We still got... Uh, let's see. What's the day? The second? We still got 10 days of school left here before the kids get out. Let me check what's going on with this field. Needs lime and it's not fertilized. Alright, I got a lot of fertilizing to do, so let's get rid of this. And it looks like my little cedar's missing patches left and right. I'm going to take this canola right here. I don't think I even bought my farm tractor. Uh, I'm sorry, my farm truck. Okay, so which one of these? Which one of these? This is straws. Okay, th this one here is the compost machine. Not worried about compost right at the moment. Uh... Uh, this one is for p uh, pigs, and this one must be for cattle. Straw, silage, and hay. Okay. Now, this one does not take... I don't think it takes canola. It takes soybeans, it says. All right. Well, I'm not going to put all my canola in for fuel. So, let's put this in the tank... All right. And then take the truck and put it away. I got so much I want to do. It's always so much to do on the farm. Okay, so now what was I going to do next? I need that fertilizer guy. There we go. Got to get him going. So, so I'm not going to get any yield on those crops if I don't do this. Okay, so we're going to do, this is field what, four? All right, field four. We're going to do that and that. Field four, we're going to boost that to 30 meters instead of 18. Going to do one of those, and we're going to go clockwise. Generate field four. You know what? Well, okay. I'll do this for now. I'm going to change that because eventually I'm going to have one of them big boom sprayers. So, I won't I won't be using this. thing in the rear okay and uh, hopefully it's doing its thing 
All right, so now it's 50% fertilized. We're up here, it's nothing. Okay, we'll let that guy go. Let's get the combine. Whoop, I ran right into the header. I hit my head. Okay, we're going to stop that. Get rid of that. And let's go get our other field. We got lots of farming to do. Lots of farming to do. I think that cedar's done up there, but we're going to uh, clean up on aisle five. I don't think he did. Uh, I think he missed some spots. I can see them. We're not going to get anything on this field. It's going to be bad yield. Okay. This is field, what field is this? 36. Field 36. And 13.5 uh, meters. One of those, we're going to go clockwise. No, we're going to go counterclockwise. Right? Right. Counterclockwise. Let's do that. And then field 36, wasn't it? My memory's terrible anymore. Field 36. Harvest. And let's back her up. And what, what was this? Rye. Is it, does anybody know if there's... Well, it's, it's different on every one, isn't it? Um, let's see. I'm going to do... I'm going to turn it on to uh, do a windrow. I, I think rye is a weed it, or a grain. It should have windrow, I would think. So let's see if it does. And it does. Okay, so we're gonna have a windrow. I need to go and lease one of those quicker picker uppers. I thought for sure I bought one, but but uh, I did not. It shows I don't have one in the garage. So I'm gonna have to lease it though. I'm gonna leave it the same color it is. I'll leave everything standard here. Uh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Extension, I want the extension. And I'll leave the wheels alone. Okay, and then we're going to have to lease it. Lease it. Back, back, back. And I need a uh, tractor to pull it with. Doggone it. What am I going to use? Uh... Let's get the plow going on that field that we just finished with the canola. Now, hopefully, that fertilizer will do me good and uh, I'll get a better yield. All right, so field five again. We're going to do field work. Uh, field five, generate. We're going to do uh, 24 meters. Is that right? Going to do one of those and it's going to be uh, counterclockwise. All right, save that. Field five. Field five plow.
drive the course. Kick it up a little bit. Thought I did that already, but evidently not. Okay, so we need to get uh, this tractor going. So, stop the course. It's a good looking piece of equipment. I don't really know how well it worked, but it seemed to have done okay, I guess. Missed a little bit, but. Okay, let's uh, lower that. Lower it. Turn it on. Clean up these patches here. See, we've got lag because we're close to that production. I get away from the production and it seems to be okay. Okay, now I've got potatoes. We got potatoes. Let's turn this thing off. And um, let me get off the tractor. Okay, we got silage, straw, and hay. Uh, potatoes, soybeans, and sugar beets. Potatoes, soybeans, and sugar beets. So we need sugar beets and we need soybeans. I'm not worried about a compost right now. Okay, we got potatoes for sure, right? Right, potatoes. And we've got... Uh, oh, this needs lime. Oh, shoot. I bet this one needed lime too. Oh, it did. Uh, I should have done that before I seeded it. What's he doing? Are you done? Is he done? Oh, are you done? Right. Not worried about weeds right now. Um, not necessarily worried about lime or plowing right at the moment. So, it looks like he did the fertilizing okay. I guess it looks like there's a little bit of space around the edges, but I don't know if that's just because of the map. So, okay, that's good. That's good. We need to get up here and get some uh, fertilizer here on the potatoes. So, stop the driver, turn that off. Oh, I've only got the one spreader, so I can't do the line yet. Right now, the... I think the... Uh, the fertilizer is more important, right? Alright, so this is field 35. Okay, so we're going to do field 35. Uh, that should be all good. That should be good. We're going to be going clockwise, so that's good. That's generated. Field 35. Fert. All right, let's get him started. Drive the course. Is he gonna do it right? 
by golly, looks like he's kind of... All right. Now, I did kick that up in speed, but it didn't seem to do anything. It doesn't really seem to do anything, so that's okay. I'm not worried about it. He's got a 30-foot spread, or 30 meters, 30 foot. I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you had fun. If you did, give it a like. Share it with a friend. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you back on the farm the next episode. In the meantime, happy farming.